Light Talk episode 4. So hi guys, welcome back to a new episode. My name is Manny and you can find me on our Facebook page at Retard Pro. Yeah, you better go check out that site. <laughs> anyway, so today we're going to talk about our latest pro tutorial light setup. So basically I'm going to discuss the complete light setup for our Instagram a pro tutorial. This is also a double pack. Next week we're going to have again a light talk for that certain Instagram a pro tutorial. It is because we have separate methods and separately work with it but it's kind of the same concept overall we wanted to have two Instagram shots. Anyways let's get right into it. As you guys can see on the screen I've popped up already the first image. This was very early in the morning so we got up at five o'clock and got up Lion's Head. It's a mountain here in South Africa. Yeah and basically we already prepared everything before the sun came up because today we're going to work with the light. So basically ambient light from the sun and two strobes. So on the one side we used again a beauty dish but not just, just silver reflectant, we used a grid as well for that. So basically again place the grid right in front of it. Let me just change things here like so. In order first of all, like that, in order first of all to control just the light and to just narrow it straight onto the guy's face and a little bit of the upper body side. So you get some nice pumping light from that. Then as well we also use for the back another quadra just with the diffusing material on there from it's like a small plastic lid that actually goes right on the quadra light. I'm going to put it up here on the screen for you guys. So we place that in the back to give him a really nice backlight. As you guys can see also here in shot number two we don't have any light the sun is almost coming up and we have no light from the beauty dish we've literally turned that away and I just flashed the one quadra light from the back so literally just with that diffusing material in order to see how strong that light would come from the back already. Then as well, also the sun came up and we took another reference shot just here with the sun as well. Literally you guys can already see how that sunlight is giving the guy a really nice orange rim light around him and just makes for another wow <laughs> in the shot. Okay, yeah, and then actually exposure number four, the latest shot and every light was on, all were pretty good. So from the front, the beauty dish, with the grid as well from the back, the quadra light pumping up the back and we get some nice front sunlight. Then as well for the whole project I also shot with F10 uh, just to keep everything very really nice and sharp as well also compensating obviously for the harsh sunlight coming from the front so nice detail there as well. Then 1 over 1 25th of a second again compensating for my flash and for the small quadra lights as well we also work just with quadra ranges again. Then also ISO 200, so pumping it up a little bit further to get a little bit more boost in the highlight and also pushing it a little bit further because I didn't want to take the F, uh, my shutters all the way down so trying to not get away with some blurry shots there. Then as well 24 to 70 at 32 millimeters again, love working with that 24 70. Yeah, so that was basically all for the first start shooting the first part of that project. Then later I went back home and back home I just took the iPhone basically and also literally a friend of mine holding the iPhone and on the iPhone basically I just wanted the hands and the phone, not more. I didn't, the background obviously we're going to comp out all of that. So again shooting just into a pure white background so basically I just chose a white wall at my house and then as well just lit it right from the top again this time with a strip light with just normal diffusing material right from the top so if you're with the hand would be here somewhere over here and shooting straight into the hand so literally just getting a little bit of light on top of the phone and also spilling to the back of the phone so you would actually have that will kind of look the same like on me that we had on the day and on the mountain yeah so then again in Photoshop obviously comp everything together first of all building just the first plate to the guy the Instagrammer and then taking the shot from the phone, placing that on top with some graphics as well. Yeah, and some color adjustments, some color grading, and created a nice, awesome pro tutorial for you guys as well, which you can find on our website under retailpro.com. Yeah, guys, so that's also all for this quick Light Talk episode. If you like this episode, please hit me up with a thumbs up. If you have any questions about this, post them down below. I'm happy to give you guys feedback about this. Yeah, that's basically all. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share it with your friends, and I'll see you guys all next week, Monday, for a new 
Instagram, a pro tutorial and Photoshop tutorial. Thanks guys, bye bye.